Microphone four. Sarah Chambers, CTU, Local One. I oppose Resolution Two. In Chicago, we have lived under the Common Core standards a few years now, and these standards are crippling. They are crippling our students' education and their joy of learning. As a special education teacher, I've seen my students transform from smiling children excited about learning to now children whose faces cringe when they are made to read passages that are multiple levels above their grade level. Because with Common Core standards, they must constantly struggle and struggle to push themselves in levels that are not developmentally appropriate. And I haven't even spoken about testing, so it gets worse. This resolution speaks to the promise of the Common Core. Brothers and sisters, there is a promise, but this promise is to test, test, and over-test our babies. Do not fool yourselves, brothers and sisters. You cannot have the Common Core without high-stakes testing. Privatizers did not write these standards and fund these standards to not test our students with high-stakes exams. The Koch brothers, Walton Foundation, Pearson, are not putting millions of dollars into these standards to just see my special education babies succeed. That is not what these standards are here for. I have watched my babies cry, pull out their eyelashes one by one in these tests. Say, pero maestra, no hablo inglés. Why am I taking this test? I do not speak English during these exams. This is not progressing my babies and moving them toward success. This is the promise. There's also the promise to remove teacher voice and expertise from the classroom. Brothers and sisters, you are the experts in the classroom. Do not underestimate yourselves. Finland teachers do not underestimate themselves. They create their own guidelines locally at the school and community level. There's also another promise, brothers and sisters, that rich people's children will not subject their babies to these standards. The standards and do not use these high stakes tests. We are fighting now because they took tests away from them to bring them back to us. 
You don't back down from a fight. They took our standards away from us. We're going to take them back from them because that is our tool. We are the teachers. They are not the teachers. It is our profession. So I stand here in support for this for one simple reason. If someone takes something from me, I'm going to grab it right back out of that cold, twisted, sick hand and say it is mine. You do not take what is mine. And I'm going to punch you in the face and push you in the dirt because this is a teacher. These are our tools. And you sick people need to be away from us and the children that we teach. Does. They 